Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Octoduck's Pokemon. My name is Zach, but you can just call me Ducky, and in today's edition of Tier Maker Tuesday, I thought it'd be fun to go through all of the Galar Pokemon, all of the new forms, all of the new evolutions, all of the new Pokemon in general. So I found a really cool new tier, and it's got the best designs all the way down to our worst designs, all the way up here, all the way to down here. I like this format. I think that's pretty cool. I, you know, you you can't go wrong with S, A, B, C, D, but like best designs, worst designs, that's pretty cool. So we're going to run through it. Of course, I have to preface with this. If you guys have a different opinion, you are totally entitled to that. Maybe you like Galarian Meowth. I don't know. Maybe you don't like Score Bunny. Whatever. Whatever the case may be, leave a comment in the comment section down below. I'd love to have a conversation with you guys. And of course, this is just my opinion. You guys are totally entitled to all of your other opinions, anything that contradicts what I say. But with all that out of the way, let's get into this video. So the first thing we have is Galarian Meowth, and automatically I'm going to put this in the worst designs. It's never happened where we have a worst designs right off the bat, but I don't like Galarian Meowth. It looks strange. I just don't like the design. I really like the story behind it. It's a Viking, but if you didn't know, if you look at it from behind, there's no fur, because that whole thing is a beard, and it's weird, and it's creepy, and it makes me feel gross. So, Galarian Mr. Mime. No, Galarian, Galarian Meowth. I was looking at Galarian Mr. Mime. Galarian Meowth goes in the worst designs. Galarian Ponyta. Um, I'm going to give it a good enough. It's good enough. It's a pony. It's a unicorn. And they did a good job with the design, but it's not a fairy type, so I'm not a fan. <laughs> uh, Galarian Meowth. Meowth. Why am I saying all the wrong names today, Duck Squad? Galarian Rapidash. Wow, can we get rid of those notifications? Thank you. My Gmail sendings about are out of date. Galarian Rapidash, I like a little bit better, even though it's still a psychic type. I think it's pretty good. It's it's better than vi good enough, you know? It's better. Um, Galarian Mr. Mime. Meh. Don't hate it, don't love it. Like the ice typing. Makes it new. Corsola, I think it's a really good design. Like, it's bleached coral. I'm learning about this in one of my classes right now, and so it's, like, really cool to see, like, the science behind it. And it's basically about how climate change is making our uh, oceans bad, you know? Pollution and such, depriving coral of oxygen, and we have coral bleaching going on, and so they had to, they made one about this, and good on, good on you, Game Freak. Good on you. Galarian Zigzagoon. Like it. It's pretty good. It's, it's cute enough. Galarian Lanoon. Same thing. They're both the same thing. Galarian Darumanka. I like it. I like it. I think it's a cool ice version of Darumanka without just being a white version of Darumanka. However, Galarian Darmanitan scares me. It's got, like, a ball on its head. I don't know what it's supposed to... I mean, like, it's supposed to be the Abominable Snowman, but... Ugh. Gives me the creeps. Gives me the creeps. Galarian Yamask. Uh, don't hate it. Don't love it. It's not a bad design, but it's also not, like, amazing, awesome design, you know? Galarian Stunfisk. I just think it's a bad design. I, I, it's a bear trap, but it's also ugly, and it's a ground steel type, which makes me mad. Grookey. Psh, favorite Galar Pokemon so far is Grookey, for sure. Um, Thwacky just looks ugly, I'm sorry. Rillaboom. Boom! Best designs. Scorebunny, I like the design. I think it's a good design. Um, I don't know the middle evolution's name of Scorebunny. Sorry, guys. But it's good enough. It's got like a bandana, which is pretty cool. And then Score Bunny something. Raboot. Raboot is in the same in the same boat as uh the middle evolution. It's okay. Sobble, I really like Sobble. It, its design is just really cool. It's a shy chameleon. And in mm, oh no. I forgot the middle evolution name again. Sorry, uh, it's pretty cool. It looks emo. <laughs> and Inteleon. Oh boy, I'm an Inteleon hater. They could have gone so many better different ways with Inteleon, but instead they decided to make it look long. 
Yeah. All right, Squovet. It is a pretty good representation of a squirrel. Greedent. Uh, yeah, I like Greedent's design, actually. I think it's it's really funny. Rookie D. Yeah, I like Rookie D. I like Rookie D. Corvus Squire. It's not as good. But Corvic Knight. Best design. Blipbug. Blipbug's pretty cool. I like Blipbug. Bug. Dotler. I love Dotler. I'm using Dotler and Corvic Knight on my team. If you guys haven't noticed, like, this is my team except for Sobble. Like, I have a Grookey and I have a Dotler and I'm going to have a Corvic Knight. I have a Corvus Squire right now. But you know what I'm saying. Or Beetle. Not the best design, TBH. Like, not the best. I don't know. It's just... It looks too much like a Ladybug. And it's supposed to be a Beetle. And for me, it just doesn't do it. But... It's really powerful and it's got some cool uh typing bug psychic. So I keep it on, I kept it on my team. Next, we have this Pokemon that I'm blinking on the name. I'm blank I this is so new to me. I just don't remember the name, but I really like its design and its evolution, which I do not remember either. I also really like its design. Gossifleur, it was one of the first to be announced. It was good enough. It was good enough. Eldegoss gives me the creeps. It's just meh. Wooloo, it's a Mareep copy, but it's adorable. And Double, Double's a little bit worse because it's kind of scary looking. <laughs> Choodle, I don't like Choodle. I don't. It's cute, but Dreadnought is so much better. I wanted to use Dreadnought. I couldn't get... I Because I'm using a different Pokemon, I can't use Dreadnought for typing and such. Yamper, adorable. Love it. Bulltound, love it. Roly Coley. Uh, they could have been more creative with this, with the design itself. Carcoal. Eh. Colossal. I really don't like its name, but it's powerful and it looks really cool, so good. Um, Applin. It's an apple. And then there's... Uh, the apple. Flapple. Flapple. Flapple is a, a dragon apple. Appleton, adorable. I wish I had Pokemon Shield just because of Appleton. And then we have something before Sandaconda. And it's not an awful design. But Sandaconda is also not an awful design. Cramorant, I think that's a pretty cool Pokemon. Aracuda, yep, Aracuda. It's um it's a it's just it's just there. Bearscuta, I think is a lot better. Yeah, let's put you there. Toxel, adorable. I love Toxel. Toxricity, on my team. <laughs> um, Sizzlepeed, not the biggest fan of, to be honest. Centiscorch is better. Centiscorch is definitely better. Clobopus, I love the name. I love the design, too. It's a fighting octopus. You know, what else? And then its evolution is just as good. Yeah. Um... The uh, pre-evolution of Poltegeist is just a Tebow, teacup. Poltegeist, about the same. Hatina, uh, I'm not a huge fan of Hatina, or whatever its middle evolution is, but Hatterene is pretty good. Hatterene is powerful. Impidimp scares me. Whatever the middle evolution scares me even more. Grimmsnarl scares me so unbelievably much, but it's a good design. <laughs> Obstagoon. You couldn't tell. It's on my team! Wow. Yeah. Um, this is called Berserker, and it's better. It is definitely better than Galarian Meowth, because Berserker actually has, like, some some design aspects to it, besides the fact that it's just fluffy. Cursula. Uh, I really wish they would have done more with Cursula, because the Corsula is one coral, and then the Cursula is just a bunch of them together, and they could have done more. Surfetched, on my team. Awesome design. Mr. Rhyme, I get it. I think it's good for what it, its purpose is. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce this. Runarigus or something. It's based on runes from Vikings. That's really, really cool. I like that design. Milkery, Milsery, however you want to pronounce it. It's just a blob. I don't like it. Alcremi, it's good. Alcremi's good. Phalanx, oh my gosh. I love the name. I take Latin. Phalanx is just like the way the Romans would, uh, I guess, arrange themselves when going off to war. And it, it it's such a cool Pokemon design. 
I wish I could use it, but I just don't have room because I have surfetched. Uh, pin urchin. It looks like Puku Muku. I'm not gonna be not gonna not gonna lie to you on that one. Snom. It's an adorable name. It's an adorable Pokemon. Yes. Um, I was just something. It's a moth. It's a ice moth, and it's got a really good design. So boom. And then there's the Stone Edge Pokemon, and I get what it's based off of, but it's base, it's meh. And then ESQ, uh, I really don't like the design because it's just an ice cube on on a penguin. Yeah, Indidi, it's a like a mix between a Meowstic and an Esper, but it's pretty good. More Pico, about the same. It's a Pikachu basically, but I like the idea that it uh, gets angry. <laughs> and now there's Kufant. Kufant is an elephant that is a steel type. It's good enough. Copper Jaw, I think, is just as good. Draco Zolt. I don't like any of these fossil Pokemon, whatever these are called, except for Arctovish. I like Arctovish a little bit better. Duraludon, I liked at first, but now I'm not a big fan. Dreepy. Dreepy is adorable. And then the middle evolution is pretty good, too. But the final evolution is... I forgot what its name is, but I like its design a lot. Here is Zacian, the Pokemon that I'm going to be using. And I really like its design. Let's make this a little bit smaller, just as we conclude. Yep, there we go. Zamazenta. I also really like Zamazenta's design. They had some really good legendaries. And finally... I forgot the name again. Whatever this is, I really like it. Um, I, yeah, I totally forgot the name. So here is my tier list of all of the new Gen 8 Pokemon and all of the new Pokemon forms. Of course, you guys can disagree with this. That's all. That's all uh, your opinion. But that's what we look like for now. There are a lot of Pokemon in this video, and this was a very long video. I apologize if you uh, if you were expecting a shorter video today. But anyways, that's just about going to do it for the video today. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, share. Always, always, always do those things. It makes me happy, and hopefully my videos make you a little bit happier. I get the bad pulls, so you don't have to. I'm Akaduck's Pokemon.